you're Leon? That's what it says on my dog tag. Where's the rest of the squad? They got us. Damn volatiles. This is where my story ends, bro. Hey, man, don't talk like that. Is there any more survivors? Aren't you the blind optimist? Chris. <sighs> he punched through and went that way. The black guy. I think it was his doing. Get the power back. It's the only way to get the elevators working. The terminals are in the basement connecting both towers. Please, take this letter and give it to my wife. She's on the ship. Yeah, sure. You can count on me. Just hang in there. I'll find Chris. Bro, I know what happened with the power. I'm on it now. I'll connect these terminals and restore the power. Did you find any of my boys? Only Leon and possibly Chris. The rest, uh, they didn't make it, Ro. I'm sorry. <sighs> okay. Just, uh, be careful, Aiden. We can't lose any more men. <laughs> Bro, I'm here. The power won't come back on. Shit. You'll have to check the fuses. Oh, <laughs> 
have. I think I restored the power. Get the cable from the power distribution room and get out of there. This could better work.
The elevators are working. All right. I did it. Ever gotten a medal, Pilgrim? Never. I'll cut you one. Out of a potato. We're going up to set up a temporary camp. See you on the eighth floor. Leon. I'm sorry, Ro. He... he didn't stand a chance. I knew it was a fucked up idea to come here. I got something for you. Thanks for what you did for my boys. I... I know you really tried to help them. What is this? A proximity tool. The GRE tagged more important goods with special RF markers. This might come in handy. Once all the antennas are working, you can use it to detect important containers and stuff. Lord knows what's waiting for us once we actually get to the roof. But you won't be alone. You'll have my men with you. And Lieutenant Rowe himself. You're coming? I've had enough of leading from the back and hearing my people die. All right, let's go then. We're waiting for Matt. He's bringing the transmitter and he'll oversee the operation from here. So you have some time for a nap or to take a dump. Just somewhere outside the camp, pretty please. Crying, man? I ain't crying. Fuck off. I just missed the fucker, okay? <laughs> you know what Leon would do if he saw you like that? At this point, he'd <laughs> probably bite my eyes out. Mind if I join you? Be our guest. How you feeling about the mission, Aiden? Honestly, I'm not too optimistic. I know this has been fucked so far, but Lieutenant Rowe always saves a day, remember? So, what are you looking forward to after this is over? My wife, Marsha. Our child is due any day now. I'm over the moon. And we've been trying for a long time to have a kid. And it seems finally I did something right. See? I told you somebody needs to come over and give you some help. 
<laughs> oh, nice boots you got there. Oh, thanks, man. I got them at the bazaar. Real cheap, too. Oh, no, did you have to? Now he won't shut up about them. Yeah, he traded his official PK knife for them. And when Roe found out, I had to clean latrines for a week. But it was worth it, no? Now, I have my eye on a nice jacket at the same place. Just can't afford it at the moment. But this mission will earn me some extra, so I can buy it soon. Will you shut up already? We don't care about your wardrobe. You're just jealous, because you look like ass, and I get all the pussy. <laughs> all your mothers, you mean. <laughs> I'm not sure he's a hard ass. Of course he is. You know his story, right? You've seen the burns on his face and neck. I was there when he barged into a burning dark zone just to pull out one private. Yeah, the guy can be harsh, but... Not a lot of people will lay it on the line like he has. Damn right. Can you tell me anything else about Ro? When he and Matt had a major falling out? Yeah, it was hell. Squad 101 had orders to take over the old city warehouse. Thought it was empty until they went inside. It turned on their flashlights and looked up. The ceiling was weird, covered with clumps of rags. And then the rags jumped down. They were a fucking scary breed of infected clinging to the roofs and walls. Hundreds of them. God, you could hear the boys' screams for miles. Fuck. Imagine that. They radioed command, but the orders were to hold the position. They didn't. They ran away. At least those who could. Afterwards, Jack ordered their executions. They were deserters. But Roe defied Jack. Said that sending them there was a mistake in the first place. We thought Jack would have Roe shot for insubordination. Sure did. Okay. Time to get some shut eye. Just a moment, gents. Special treat for the night. Wow! You rock, Lieutenant. Here's to our fallen comrades. To the fallen. And pretty ladies. Why do you want to exclude your wife? <laughs> <laughs> Hang it in there, guys. We are, Lieutenant. We've been through worse, right? Remember the volatiles in the old port? Well, that was a carnage. It was, and we pulled through. We'll have another good story to tell our families. Am I right? You are, sir. Something's bothering me, Aiden. The renegades. And what about them? They're everywhere. Spreading in the city like cockroaches. But here... The biggest antenna in the city, strategic place, and no renegades at all. Ah, it's not like anything else they're doing makes sense. Good point. First, someone turned on the electricity. No idea why. And then, when I questioned a renegade officer, he babbled something about GRE facilities they're trying to locate. Didn't make much sense if you ask me. X-13 or something like that. But I'm worried what they're planning. X-13? I've, I've heard about that place before. Oh, yeah? What did you hear? I know that Waltz is hunting for it as well. Any idea where it could be? Well, if it's real, it could be a GRE complex. Top secret. Well hidden. But once we're done with this motherfucker, maybe we figure out what it is and find it first. But for now, get some beauty sleep. Infected like us more when we're rested. That was a nice tune you played. Let's hear some more. Yo, Sleeping Beauty! Aiden! The head honcho's here, let's roll! And Matt brought the transmitter? Safe in my pocket, boy.
You expect us all to fit in here? A little snug, ain't it? Whose finger's in my ass? <laughs> now that's what I call snug. <laughs> you kidding me? This bong's probably so loose you could fit a whole fist in there. How'd you like my fist in your face? Fuck you. I try... Hey, then. You're doing great so far. Yeah, we're trying. Right, bro? I've got good news for you. I've received intel on a certain GRE doctor. Who is it? Where? I still need time. Let's finish our job here first. You and the squad will go to the top of the tower and mount the transmitter. Ro will be with me down below. I'm going too. Ro, this again? Really? We have a plan. Fuck the plan. We don't know what's up there. I'm not sending my men up there alone. Fuck the plan? Not losing my squad again. You know I have to go. <sighs> Fucking come back. Understood? Yes, sir. If you need anything, you can reach me over the radio. I'm fine. Get to work. Sir, you all right? Go already. Joke? No, where's Bowski? Fuck, please. Oh, I'm begging you. I'll give you my last clean pair of undies if you spare us another one of your jokes. Keep calm, gentlemen. Oh. Where's Bowski? Fuck. Sorry, boss. Won't say it, Pete. You're off key, dumbass. It went like this. Whoa. Commander, sir, what's going on? Elevator stopped. The power's unstable again. It's a huge building. We're on it. Alright, boys. The repairs will take some time. We can't wait. It's footwork from here. What floor are you on? 30. So you got another 50 to the roof. Right, boys. You heard the commander. Open her up. Let's get hiking. Where's Bowski? Recon.
Jack. Jack, you there? There's... There's been an attack. Only I made it. Fuck. No, Edro? I, I don't know. I, I don't see him. Aiden. Ro had the transmitter. Locate it. It's our only chance. It's no time to mourn. You must find Ro. We'll get you help as soon as the elevators are back up. I'll do what I can.
Survived. I thought you were dead. They fucking wish. You'll pull through, Ro. Just hang in there. Oh, well, I will. The transmitter? Matt said you have it. I do. You can't lose it, Aiden. You can't. Here. The transmitter. Aiden. Don't you... I think you should wait for that potato medal I promised you. What? You withdrawing my commendation, Lieutenant? Oh, shut up. It's just... Uh, our dog tags. Don't let my boys be forgotten. If you see a fallen man, please take his tag. <sighs> they deserve it, son. Trouble. The PKs are all dead. I warned you. If you get yourself killed, I swear I'll come in there and find a way to bring your lifeless corpse back to life just so I can kill you myself. Spare me the lecture, okay? Just come down from there already. I'm not coming down. I need to get higher. I'm gonna find a way up.
Locked. I'm stuck here, Luan. I need help. I'll get Frank. Hurry! Frank. Thirtieth floor. The infected. They, they blew up. Fuck it. I told you. Frank, wait. Where are you going? He's as good as that one. I'm sorry. This is where I lost all my night runners. I'm not going through that again. He's not dead yet. He's there, and he needs you. He needs a cop. That's what he needs. Frank, you smelly old alcoholic cunt. Yeah, 
Frank, I think I found it. What's it for? It's a grappling hook. A rope launcher. It's a what? We'll help you climb. Aim it at something it can attach to, and shoot. Try to use it to get onto the terrace. Let me know once you've done it. Okay. I think I'm getting the hang of it, Frank. Sure you are. It's simple. But it can save your ass. Where to now? Where you were headed, Aiden. Upstairs. You have to go up one level. From there, you're gonna go to the side wing. Where right to the side wing? The main wing is full of infected. Go. You have several floors to climb. <laughs> 